Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a get ready with me running late edition. Basically, my go to hair and makeup for when I am late. So, if you're in a rush but want to look a little bit more put together than just doing nothing at all, this is basically what I do to make my hair look voluminous and put together and my makeup so I don't look like I just woke up and rolled out of bed even if I just did. So, I'm using for my hair the Vanity Planet Flow Straightening Brush. And what I love about this is it's really perfect for when you're in a rush. You can kind of brush your hair and straighten it all at once. And the great thing about this is that it leaves your hair really voluminous so unlike a normal flat iron that leaves a crease and just makes your hair very limp this leaves your hair with a lot of volume and in the end as you can see the difference from the side I brushed to the side I didn't uh, but it looks so much more put together than if I were to just have left it so if you're interested in trying this out be sure to check out the description box below where I have a link and code for you guys to save 50% off um, so it's actually $40 for this, which I think is really, really good for a heat tool. And it saves you tons of time in the morning. So, yeah. And huge thank you to Vanity Planet for sponsoring this video. Um, I think it's such a cool idea. And obviously, you guys can see it works really, really well. But after I do all of that, I like to add a little bit of oil. This is by Madam CJ Walker. And it's this nice seed oil that makes my hair really shiny and mends my ends to um, make it extra smooth and sleek and also smells amazing, which is always a great thing. So that's basically it for the hair. Um, I love the way it turns out because I still have a lot of volume with my hair, which I usually don't have as much with just a regular straightener. Um, so I think that's really, really cool. So moving on to makeup, I'm starting off with moisturizer and primer as always. And then going in with a wet beauty blender and some NARS concealer. I'm just dabbing basically my under eye area and any discolorations and blending it all out. But not applying too much. Um, but if you want, you can apply like a tinted moisturizer or a actual foundation depending on your skin type and preference and all that. How much coverage you want. But I like just applying a little bit of concealer just to save time and um, have less product. And then I'm going in and I'm just using a single shade of eyeshadow and it's just this nice peachy color to just kind of um, cancel out any discoloration going on in my eye lid area and warm it up as well. And then I'm applying some chapstick because I can't deal with chapped lips. And then I'm just doing my eyebrows a little bit, just basically what I typically do, but just less product and blending it out more just because I don't want the focus of my face to be my eyebrows since I have less product on than I usually do. And then of course I got to apply some bronzer and highlighter just to contour just a little bit and add a glowiness to my face and the highlighter helps so much because it definitely makes me look more awake and leaves my skin dewier and just brighter which is very very important when you want to um, just keep it as simple as possible that's very very fundamental and I have this weird habit of mixing lip colors like I'm never satisfied with just one color so these two colors I just like the consistency of this Too Faced peach um, collection lip gloss and then this ColourPop lip color and uh, the ColourPop lip color is a little drying so I add the gloss just to make it more plump and moisturized and then I actually am going to do a cat eye. This is totally optional. I do this because it takes me a minute, but you obviously don't have to do a cat eye if you don't have the time or you don't typically do that. But I feel like it just completes the look and does so much for me and doesn't take that long anyway. But that is basically it for the makeup and hair look. This whole thing took me about 10 minutes. I hope that this helped you in your routine when you are running late. Um, but thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you guys liked it. Be sure to let me know in the comments what other videos you want to see me do. And yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe as well. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Bye.